Hi, my name is Callista Respondek, and today I'm going to be talking to you about business etiquette in the workplace. So, business etiquette is probably the most important thing you'll ever need to master. Everyone wants to receive a job offer from their GM occupation. There are a few ways you can set yourself apart above competing applicants and a step closer to receiving that offer. One of that being your business etiquette and your ability to fit in in the workplace. Just like you, I am a young professional still in my learning process, striving to make it in the business world. Becoming familiar with business etiquette will be the first and most important step. I guarantee that by the end of this presentation, you will have a great idea of what information and tools you will need to succeed in this world of work. As a student in business administration, I have spent a lot of time becoming familiar with business etiquette. I'm here today in order to help you understand what business etiquette is, along with why it is essential to the workplace and to your career. After speaking with you today, I hope that you will be able to absorb this information as well as apply it to the real world. To begin, let's talk about what business, business etiquette really means and why it is so important in any career, career you may find yourself in. The collection of rules by which it is, sorry, it is a collection of rules by which you conduct business is known as business etiquette. Essentially, it is a common language that once embraced becomes standard practice in a community, allowing that group to work more smoothly and with fewer misunderstandings. This facilitates a professional standard of behavior that each business has in common with other businesses. Additionally, business etiquette refers to how a corporation represents its health to its consumers and suppliers. It is also how a company connects with everyone else in its value chain. In the marketplace, business etiquette is what distinguishes one organization from another. For any company to grow and prosper, business etiquette is essential. In business, the relationships that you build are very important. If you want to further your professional career, take on new clients, impress your boss, or seal that final deal, establishing a good rapport is critical. In the business world, exercising your proper manners are Exercising proper manners is the best approach to develop strong, positive relationships. There are several different components that fall into the concept of basic business etiquette. Now that we know a little bit about what it is, let's talk about a few of those ideas and how they apply to business. Number one, your functionality. Whether you might be going to work or meeting a client somewhere outside of the office, you should always do your best to arrive at least five minutes early. By arriving on time at work or meeting, this not only demonstrates that an employee is dedicated to their job, but it shows that they value the customer's time, making them feel more important. Dressing appropriately. If the office dress code requires that everyone adhere to an official dress code, this must be observed and followed without fail. Fridays should not be taken to their logical conclusion or to an extreme. Business etiquette dictates that each and every individual follows their organization's dress code and keeps within the confines, confines of this code at all times. Three, being personable. If any professional situation, having a pleasant and friendly attitude is beneficial. Colleagues going out of their way to greet one another each morning is an example of this. Having a personable personality also includes remembering the names of the coworkers and customers and being prepared to express gratitude, gratitude for any assistance extended your way also demonstrates courtesy. Or being respectful, especially in shared spaces. Regarding shared spaces in the workplace, being respectful of all of them can be shown in many different ways. I'll go ahead and name a few specific examples of how this can be done. One, don't overuse the coffee machine and once you finish the final cup, start a new batch. Two, don't leave copies of documents thrown about the com communal copier that should otherwise be thrown away. And three, maintain a respectful and professional demeanor when conversing with both coworkers and clients. Now that I've told you about some of the basic components of business etiquette, I will now tell you about some of the benefits of it. Number one being it creates a good first impression. You only get one single chance to make a good first impression. Practicing business etiquette ensures that you never miss an opportunity to shine. The manner in which employees speak and dress reveals a lot about the company as a whole. Being on time will also make a positive first impression. Customers and potential clients will take your company seriously if you demonstrate that you do too. When people are confident in their abilities, it shows in their business etiquette, which places them on a par with or above other experts. Two, it makes relations at the workplace better. A better work environment can be achieved by providing employees and coworkers with professional interactions. 
There will be no room for familiarity, which could lead to concerns such as complaints of sexual harassment and so on. Interactions will be civilized and proper since professionalism will always be at the forefront of your mind. Overall, respect will help you create a positive working environment. Increased growth in business. A person who conducts oneself professionally is more trustworthy worthy than someone who conducts himself in an unprofessional manner. When a company enforces good business etiquette, customers will typically stay with them for a longer period of time. Furthermore, a salesman or customer-facing professional who is well-versed in business etiquette is more likely to increase sales and their professionalism will reflect through in everything they do from how they dress to how they speak and handle themselves. All of these characteristics will increase the potential customer's trust in the company and its products and services. And four being company and personal image enhancement. A company that looks well is one whose staff are dressed appropriately and have a friendly and personable demeanor. Everyone wants to be connected with a reputable organization. When business owners and staff follow all of the business etiquette guidelines, their image improves as well. By and by, appearance and mannerisms will improve and professionalism will come naturally to you. To conclude, business etiquette refers to a collection of social and professional rules that control how individuals interact in the workplace, and it is created by building strong relationships with those in the company's organization. These strong relationships are essential to have with those who consume their products or their services. Overall, it is having respect for everyone, regardless of their position in the value chain. Not only is business etiquette critical to your job advancement, but it can also allow you to demonstrate your values and belief system to others. In conclusion, business etiquette is crucial in the workplace because it fosters a professional, mutually courteous environment and enhances communication, all of which contribute to an office's productivity. When people are recognized, they feel better about their employment which translates, translates to improved customer interactions. Business etiquette is created by building strong relationships with those who consume their products or their services. It is having respect for everyone regardless of their position.